Um, ladies and gentlemen, if we were going to solve this, all right, it does not mean to sketch. That was from a previous video. But what I want to do is I want to solve this, all right? So what I need to do is I need to isolate my, ex my exponent. Just like when we were solving logarithms, we need to isolate the logarithm. Here, I need to isolate this base. So I'm going to divide. First step is divide by 8 on both sides. So now I have 3 raised to the 6 minus x equals 40. Well, obviously, 40 divided by 8 is what? 5. Five. OK. Now, if you guys remember, when we had 3x equals 9, remember, by using our one-to-one -one properties, we could say, oh, well, that's the same thing as 3x is the same thing as 3 squared, right? And then you could just say x equals 2. But now we have a problem here, right? Because we, we can't raise 5 to the base 3, right? Without being some kind of crazy number, we'd have to be able to solve for. So what we can do, there's two different methods we can go. This is an exponential equation. We can rewrite all exponential equations in law, logarithmic form. So if I did that, notice that's like in parentheses as its own expression. It'd be log base 3 of 5 equals 6 minus x. Right? So then, to solve for x, I would subtract 6. So then I have log base 3 of 5 minus 6 equals negative x. Then let's get rid of the negative, right? So I divide by negative 1. So my final answer is x equals a negative log base 3 of 5 minus 6. All right? So now I just need to fi figure out that value. Yeah, now, um, well, sorry. That's all in parentheses. So yeah, you could distribute it if you wanted to, but I'm just going to leave it on the outside. Um, so you have a question, problem? OK. Um, so if you have a calculator that has the log base, you can just put in log base 3 of 5. If you don't, you're going to have to use change of base. All right? So I'll distribute that if you guys, since you guys want me to. So to distribute this, I'm going to have to use change of base. Now remember, guys, you can use any base. You can use log base 10. Or log or ln. It doesn't matter what the base. Doesn't matter what the base is. You just need to take what your value is over um, the ln of the base, and then plus six. So now what I'll do is I'll do ln or negative ln of five divided by ln of three, and then add six, and my answer is four point five four. Okay. And that's it. So here's how.